Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a reading. Being said, this is a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. So please do take whatever resonates with you, whatever you're feeling comfortable with and just leave the rest of it aside. If ever you do have any questions and you would like to inquire about having a personal reading, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com and it will be my great pleasure to send you the necessary information. You can also find all of that information, well, how to contact me into the YouTube drop box right below this video. On another note, if you do enjoy the channel and you have not yet subscribed, please do take a brief moment of your time to click the subscribe button to show your to show your support for the channel and for myself, and it is greatly appreciated. So, with no further ado, let's begin this reading. So, what we want to know here is, will he or she leave me? So I'm using here the Lenormand and I'm also using a Kipper deck. So let's just turn these over and see what kind of message we can get. Are they lying or are they saying the truth to you? I have the Lady, I have the Maze, I have the Fox, I have the Mice, I have the Magnifying Glass. I have a Main Mail, I have Lovers, and I have a House. Okay, so the answer here because I like you know for those of you who know me now I do like to give the answer right away because I think it's fair so I am going to tell you that they are going to be leaving um, they're going to be leaving because of another person um, and they're just you know feeling not um, they're not feeling the love anymore into this relationship is really what is going on um, I have over here the, the lady, and the lady represents you. May you be a man or may you be a woman. This is the card that represents you. And really what you're doing right here is just kind of thinking. You're, you're thinking and you're wondering. You're trying to assess the situation. You're trying to see what would you do without this person and what are going to be your plans, your plan A, your plan B, your plan C. But even more than plans and all of that, really what you're just thinking is you're thinking about them. It's like if it would be photos one after another, just you know, going over and over and over. This is what you're doing. You're just playing the film of your life with this relationship. Um, and you're trying to, you know, you're just trying to be at peace with it. That's it. You're not trying to assess really anything, nothing much. You're just trying to be at peace with what is. Um, I do feel that being said that... Um, I already told you the answer, but I mean, I have the cards here who are saying also, I feel like you're stuck and you're just stuck and I don't feel like it's the first time that you're stuck into this maze, the maze being your life, being your relationship. You're stuck in this cycle and you see other people, other people are out and they're doing their things. They're out there and how did they get out there is the question. How did they get out of the maze? Um, how come you keep going back into these circles over and over and over again and you're unable to get out? At this point, I do have to say that perhaps you need to go back a few steps and go see exactly where it begins to be blocked. And then you will have your answer to be able to correct that so it doesn't happen again because, you know, this is not fun for anybody. Um, that being said, this really does say, you know what? I'm stuck. I don't want to be stuck. I want to get out. I want to be like the other people here. How can I do that? How can I undo myself from being into this place? Um... And really, uh, really do try and assess, please. Try and assess this situation over here so you're not stuck into this uh, maze type of place again. Um, I feel as though this has been going on for quite some time into your relationship, the discord, the conflict, uh, wondering what was going to happen. I think they've even said before that they were going to leave and they've never left. Um, I feel as though with the mice here that this is just, you know, that's enough. You know, it, it's eating away at you and you just can't take it anymore. Um, you just want to have the truth and you want to know, you know, what is coming up for the next. Are you going to work on it or not? Uh, these are all these type of questions that you're going to have to ask your partner. Um, I do have the manic flying glass, which is really trying to warn you. It's really trying to tell you, you know what, something is happening. Please do verify. Please do see what is going on into this relationship and look into the fine print, okay? Um, as I said, I do believe that they are going to be leaving so if there are any legal papers or you do own anything legally please do be very very careful read two times three times four times if you must and have somebody else with you to read it just in case um 
And so this is really about their hidden things or hidden secrets, but you need to look, you need to look into the magnifying glass in order to see it because it really is well hidden. Um, also, I had up here, I have the fox, the fox, the fox is all about trickery, it's about deception, it's about lies, it's about here, wait, you can't see it all that well. It's, uh, no, I'm, that's not the fox. That's a fox. There you go. I'm sorry about that. So it's really about trickery. It's deception. It's lies. It's devious. It's somebody who's very, very sneaky. Um, I feel as though they've been manipulating you for quite some time. Um, why? Ah, because they want to see how this other relationship was going to go. They want to see if this was even impossible. Um, and at the same time, I, I do, you know, I do know that they do love you, but that love has, you know, greatly uh, kind of um, slipped away but um, that being said our little fox here uh, you must be very very careful because they are very charming but they are not all that they seem to be this is really somebody who manipulates who takes advantage they're a schemer they are a false prophet beware okay beware I have the magnifying glass right next to it to tell you to beware and then, as I said, I think this has been going on for quite some time here because of the mice, and the mice are eating away at the rope, but the rope has almost been, it's almost done, it's almost broken, you're almost free from um, from this uh, th this situation if you want. So you're going to be able to break free, you're going to be able to go talk to your partner to try and figure out exactly what is going on to get the truth out of your partner because they don't seem to be talking about the truth all that often. And down here, you know what, I got the main man. I got the house so this here is really representing the he or the she into the relationship so the other person and them too they are thoughtful because like I said they do still love you they do it's not the same it's not the same love it's not the same amount it's not the same emotions it's really not the same we cannot compare what was and what is but that being said it is very comforting for you to know that they still do love you um, but they had a question they had um, they had a situation they had to take an answer they took the easiest answer that they could and that answer would be to be alone so um, I don't believe that they're necessarily going to go see somebody else right away neither I think they truly just want to be alone a little bit um, alone you know and and I do have the house here the house is symbolism of you know stability and security well, this unfortunately is upside down, so this is not going to be the security that you want. It's not going to englobe everything that you want, sadly enough. Um, please do remember that this is a general reading, so it might not resonate with you. So please do take whatever does resonate with you and just leave the rest aside. If you'd like a reading, romancefultarot at gmail.com. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I do wish you a fantastic day, and I'll be seeing you soon.